Yo, 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 what is going on YouTube? It's your boy, Technically T, hitting y'all with another case review video today for the iPhone 12 Pro Max, and we have cases up on deck from Pataka. So, of course, huge shout out to Pataka, as always, hooking me up with cases to review. Now, we do have two cases, two different colors, and then we have the Pataka Air. So, the Pataka Mag Easy case, we do have in a blue, which I think is the very first time that I've actually reviewed a blue Pataka case. So, that's going to be pretty dope. Pataka Air, just in your standard black carbon fiber. And we also have another Mag Easy case, and that's going to be also in the black carbon fiber. So, you already know the deal. Let's go ahead and review and slap this one on. We'll review this one because this is the first, and then we're going to slap this one on so you can see the black. So, let's go ahead and get into it. All right, first up, Pataka Mag Easy case. Now, if you see my channel, you've seen me review these cases for. Tons of different phones. I think I even reviewed these for the 12 Pro. I do so many case reviews these days. I don't know which one I've done for what phone. But here we go. 100% genuine air mid carbon fiber. 7 grams, 17 grams of lightness. 0.85 millimeters of thinness. Wireless. Charging. Friendly. Flip it over on the back. If you know about Pataka, they have their own kind of, well, the MagSafe thing. I want to say that they did it first. Apple kind of went back and kind of bit it a little bit, but that's for another video. But they do have their own type of magnetic charging system. Now, we're not really going to review that system in this video. We're just going to do what's going on with the actual case itself. So there's the case. We're going to go ahead and set this down. Take a look inside of it. We basically give a little catalog to let you know the the products that Pataka has with their car, you know, vent charger and different things like that. We get that QR code, get VIP treatment, and we do get a little sticker here. So if your fit isn't right, these things fit so thin and so snug, you can just basically pop one of these little stickers up in the case and it's going to help your fit out. But to be honest with you, I've never had an issue with these cases with them fitting funny or not fitting correctly to use one of those stickers. So I don't really see the need. But let's go ahead and look at the Pataka Mag Easy case here. So once again, it's made out of that air mid carbon fiber. And you already know with these cases, you're not going to get tons of protection. This case is for my super minimal minimalistic people out there who want to rock a case just want a little bit of bump protection or something like that this is who this case is made for so when it comes to the top you're going to have a little bit of that top open of course we'll see that once we get it up on the actual phone on that right side we have it completely closed except around where that power button is you do get a little cut out there on the bottom your butt as i always say is going to be wide open <laughs> the butt is open on the back so that's going to be something to take note of is there and on the left side you get that cut out for your volume up and down flipping it over on the back you get that cut out for your camera and you do get a little black rim that goes around it so regardless of how thin this case is you do get a little bit of camera protection and down here you do get a little bit of pataka branding there so let's go ahead and pop pacific blue 12 pro max up in here and this combination right here definitely definitely looks dope so let me go ahead and get my let me get that and wipe it off real quick so we can got with these cases you got to keep it clean so let's go ahead and check it out here so let's take a look around the case just so you know what we're working with very minimalistic case so if you're one of the people who like to keep it very thin want to keep it minimal then this is definitely going to be for you so Let's go ahead and take a look around it on that side where your volume up and down buttons are. You see, you're going to be actually pressing the buttons themselves. You don't have a cutout or anything like that. So you are going to be pressing the buttons themselves. That's just the way it is. On that top side, as you can see there, you're going to have a little bit of that stainless steel bezel out. So if you're a person that's kind of paranoid about the stainless steel bezel, you really don't want a lot touching it or you don't want to get micro scratches over time, then that could be a little area of concern there. On that right side, kind of the same thing. you got that power button right there. Flipping over on the bottom, just like I stated before, your bottom is going to be completely completely wide open so if that's an area of concern you definitely might want to check that out flipping it over on the back as you can see right here that camera is protected so although we do get that very thick camera bump on the back of the 12 pro max even with this very thin case i'm not going to say it's recessed 
but it does sit just flush all with it and, it and the lip raises up just a little bit more. So if you were to set this on the ground, you'll definitely be good to go. You're not going to be resting it on that camera module. So that's something good to take note of. Taking a look at that lay on the table protection. Now I am running a tempered glass screen protector. I will be sure to link the one that I'm using down below and the video review up top. But as you can see, man, this is a minimal case. You're basically getting no lay on the table protection when it comes to that. So if you're one of those persons that has the clumsies, you has the drops. You might want to be careful because if this bad boy falls face first, you might be in a world of trouble. But like I said, minimalist protection. People who know about Pataka, you already know what you're getting into, but you don't have any lay on the tail protection there. Now, how does the case actually fit on the phone? And once it's snapped on, it's up there. I mean, you really have to get a good corner off to get it off. It comes off pretty easy by that top right, but once it's snapped on, you don't have any issues with this popping off by itself, anything like that. It's going to be a hard snap case. So therefore, the fit and the pull test all around it is, is snug. It's a hard carbon fiber style case. But I'm going to tell you what, once this thing is popped on, there isn't any creaking going on the sides or anything like that. It is a very nice, accurate fit. What we're known to expect when it comes to Pataka cases. So great job when it comes to the fit of this. And also, how does it feel in your hand? It feels amazing. A lot of people have complained about the iPhone 12 Pro Max being a little bit too thick, but with this case, it feels really good. Gives you that feeling that yes, we do have some material in our hand and it does make it tons. I'm thinking it makes it a lot more grippy than it is just holding the phone by itself. Of course, that's what it's gonna be. And of course, you're gonna get the thinnest profile that you can just about get when we are talking about coming to a case. So very, very nice fit, high fit in your hands. Very good job from Bataka with that. So. Drop it on regular wireless charging. You already know it's going to work just fine with that regular wireless charger. And bringing it over to MagSafe. Popping it on MagSafe. So it, now I know it has its own magnet. So I don't know which one it's, it's kind of adhering to. But as you can see here, it will work with MagSafe. You just have to find that sweet spot. So I really think this thing has a couple magnets in it if i'm not mistaken so when it pops up there it's going to adhere to one of the two magnets but you really have to find the apple magnet to activate that magsafe so it might be a little bit funny just because pataka has their own and there it is right there has their own built-in magnetic but basically right there in the middle is where it's at and then you put it down it's going to start charging but it's already charging so you know where it is so it does work with magsafe and it does work with regular wireless charging so here it is this is going to be the Bataka Easy Case. This is in the blue colorway. Let's go ahead and slap that black one on to see what it looks like. And of course, if you want to keep it plain, you want to keep it stealthy, you can go ahead and rock out with the black Mag Easy Case. Now, this is also a very nice look when it comes to that Pacific Blue 12 Pro Max. But if you have any other colors, you already know you can't go wrong with black when it comes to a case. So here is the Mag Easy Case from Pataka. Next up, let's take a look at the air case. Now, what this basically is, is going to be just like your Mag Easy Case, but it's going to be super thin. It's going to be even thinner than your Easy Case. So where it says up here, thinnest and lightest case made with a genuine air made carbon fiber. Uh, once again, made of that carbon fiber, silk and soft, soft touch, 0.65 millimeters of thinness. So we're looking at even more thinner, 10 grams of lightness. So it's more lighter, luxury, selective material. So this is kind of trolling me real fast. <laughs> All right, let's get about this packaging. See what we're working with. Inside the packaging, you're going to get the same thing. That's you basically got in out of your Mag Easy. But let's take a look at it. This thing is like a... It's so feather light. Like when they say it's feather light, they are not telling any lies there. This thing is incredibly light. Taking a look at the case, you're basically going to get the same thing just like you did with the Mag Easy case. You're going to get the same characteristics. Not much is going to change between these two cases. You're going to get the tops open. This is not, we're not talking about the Mag Easy. We're talking about the, the Mag Air. So, Right side power button, you're going to have it open. When it goes to that left side, volume up and down, you're going to have that open. You're going to have that top open. You're going to have that bottom open. On the inside, you don't get a magnet with the air case. So that's something to make note of. When it comes to the Mag Easy, compatible with Pataka magnetic mount, not when it comes to the air. You're just getting straight thinness when it comes to that. Pataka branding on the inside, Pataka branding on the outside. So let's go ahead and pop this bad boy in right here. 
Yeah, super feather light, even lighter than the Easy. It's crazy, man. These things are incredibly light. But let's go ahead and take a look on that top side. As you can see, it's going to be open. Same thing with flipping it over on that bottom. That's going to be open as well, just like your Easy. On that left side, volume up and down. That area is open with that mute toggle switch. Also, when it comes to that power button, open as well. Even though with it being as thin as it is, it still has some camera protection. That's so that's very nice to see. Take a look at that lay on the table protection. Once again, you basically have no lay on table protection when it comes to this. This is even going to be thinner than the Mag Easy, so you even have to be more careful when it comes to this case. But you already know with these cases, you're not going to rock with any lay on the table protection. Now, how does it actually fit on the phone? Because we're talking about less material, even more thin. But once this is on, and you got to make sure it's on that corner. These things are on snug. Just the same excellent fit. Just like the Mag Easy, man. It, it just perfect fit. And they're very, when they're up there, it doesn't feel like it's going to pop off on the corners or anything like that. I really feel like the squared off design of the new iPhone 12 series really helps with the fit of these cases. And this is the same thing when it comes to this air case absolutely perfect fit when it comes to it no issues whatsoever and how does it fit in your hand super thin man you can definitely feel like you can definitely feel it but between holding this and this one in your hand you can tell right offhand that this one is a lot more thinner than this even though this is an incredibly thin case as that extra grip on it just as well and when i'm home i could easily find myself rocking one of these cases man i would get a little bit of paranoia going out and about but while i'm home I definitely could probably rock one of these bad boys. So let's go ahead and bring charging over here. I'm pretty sure it's going to be the exact same. Of course, it's going to work with your wireless charging. There it is right there. And let the charging reset real quick. Let's go ahead and bring over, and it is still showing the charger emblem right there. So I'm trying to get the, the kick off, and it's not being charged anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it might be an iOS bug right there, man. This thing still has the charger emblem up there. So... When you drop it on while it's charging, it's not activating because apparently it might be like a little bug going on. I don't know. Let me see if I can pause the video and get that fixed. All right. So I basically had to restart my phone. I'm not sure what was going on. I'm pretty sure that was an iOS bug. But now dropping on while it's charging, as you can see, that works perfectly fine. Taking it off while it's charging. Okay, there it is. It's good now. Popping on that MagSafe. And once we find that magnet, there it is on the back. So it is compatible with MagSafe. Not as strong as your MagSafe accessories as I always say, but it is pretty strong. So here is going to be the Pataka Mag Air Case. This is the only color that they gave me. I'm not sure if this is the only color that they make, but that is the only one that they sent. All right, so here are the cases from Pataka. We have the Air Case in the middle and we have the Pataka Mag Easy on the outsides. Love these cases. I've always liked how thin, how minimalistic they are. When I'm around the house, I can easily wear one of these cases and be perfectly fine. This is what you want. I know a lot of people when it comes to iPhones don't like anything that's super bulky. They like something that's going to be very thin and this is going to be one of the best options out there. So you already know all the links to these bad boys will be down in the description below. I'll make sure to leave them just for all the iPhones in case you want to check them out for either one of those models. And you already know, do all the YouTube things, man. Hit that sub, hit that like button, comment down below, and turn that bell on so you don't miss out on any future iPhone 12 Pro Max accessory videos. But I'm about to here, man. Everyone, please be safe. Catch you on the next one. Later.